23-year-old Femi Nandap, who had a history of mental health problems and was known to police. Nandap has pleaded guilty to manslaughter on the grounds of diminished responsibility. But Dr Ensink's baby daughter will never know her father and may one day ask who was responsible for his death. There is a not-so-secret society of people all across the UK who in their spare time reveal themselves as superheroes. You just want to be as character accurate as possible. People ask me, is that how long does it going to take you to make the costume? It's all this extra stuff. That, that took 12 years. It's a hobby known as cosplay. Hey guys, just your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. But don't think of this as just some childish game. It's actually about four to five kilos, but it's like solid metal. To these enthusiasts, whoa, it's a way of life. I don't think I could have ever stopped because of the feelings it does give me. Words like nerd or geek, once considered insults, are now worn like badges of honor. And there's a growing scene of people here in Northern Ireland who don't just enjoy the characters in these books, they spend hours, weeks, months even, on becoming them. The kid in the lab coat being no, taken no, away by cops isn't a doctor. Devices. He's just 18 years old. They say you examined a patient today. You will from my lawyer. The charge? practicing medicine without a license. He even gave himself a five-star patient satisfaction rating and claimed to specialize in chronic fatigue syndrome, depression, psychosis, psychiatric diseases, and substance abuse. He loved Robinson's name on the lobby directory. That sticker is covering up the letters MD after his name. But now the career of this wannabe Doogie Howser seems to be over.